Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So this week I'm not doing a play with me in my Erin Condren. I actually want to do a play with me in my So Much Crafting inserts, which are inside my Rose Gold Kiki K. This is a beautiful planner. I only had one problem with it and it's not even the flaking. Like, I'm probably blinding you. It is the fact that the cover is like bent. I don't know if you guys can see it. Like right here. Yeah, that's not supposed to be there. Um, so I did get a refund for this, but like, do you guys see that? It's like the rings were placed on sideways. So that's the only problem I've had with it. I've never, I don't have any flaking. Um, of course, when you rub it, like a little bit of sparkle comes off, but nothing like too terrible. And it's too beautiful to return or like anything like that, but I love it. Okay, so anyway, that's not the reason why we're here. We're here because we're going to do a plan with me. Um, so this week I'm using my So Much Crafting inserts. Um, and I'm also going to be using some items from my shop. These actually just released yesterday when you guys are watching this. So there might be some still left in the shop. And we always have a code from YouTube down below if you guys want to check out the shop. I'm going to quickly run through what I'm using. Um, so these are personal size washi strips sized to fit the Erin Condren or Erin Condren so much crafting inserts so you get two sets of those this is our personal size kit so it punches in the planner here are our vertical fill boxes and this is the lost at sea kit I'm sorry here are the headers we have our labels and then our ombre heart checklist so I'm using the full lost at sea kit um, if you guys are interested it's in the shop but yeah let's get into the planner and if you guys want a planner walkthrough let me know by giving this video a thumbs up and I can always do a Kiki K planner walkthrough all right so I was gonna do this as a regular plan with me but it was just so long I decided to do a sped up version of it um, and just do a voiceover so I'm sorry if you can hear people mowing the lawn They've been mowing the lawn for like three hours outside of my room, and I can't do anything about it. Um, so, let's jump in. So, today we are using, as you guys saw in the beginning of the video, we are using my uh, Lost at Sea kit. So, I'm just putting the washi strips down, and let me tell you guys, I need to buy undo. There were so many times in this video that I would put a sticker down and I couldn't pull it up because of just the type of paper that Danielle has. It is so luxurious that if you try and pull a sticker up, even if it's removable, which mine aren't, but even if it's removable, you will be ripping the paper up, which isn't a bad thing. It just kind of sucks. Okay, so then here I decided I've seen a Scribble Prince Co. do this before where she, um, well, here I'm punching everything. But we're just punching along, punch, punch, punch. Also, I realized in this episode I needed to buy a new hole punch because it was giving me hell. So I decided to take the extra long strips of personal size washi and put it across Saturday and Sunday for a background for the weekend banner. I've seen Squirrel Prince Co. Andrea from Squirrel Prince Co. do this in her plan with me. She uses her thick washi though, um, but I thought this was a great idea if you do buy the personal size washi. Since there is two strips of it, you could do two different ones. Alright, so I think right here I'm going to be putting the weekend banner down. Actually, maybe not. Yep, are you going to do it? Okay. <laughs> I was going to say, sometimes I watch these back and I'm like, what am I doing right here? So I put the weekend banner down and then I'm going to work on my sidebar. So usually what I do is right here, I was like, oh, I'm going to put this down 
And then I decided I wanted to put a habit tracker down. Watch. Oh, here it is right here. I was like, I'm going to go get a habit tracker. So I ran up to my desk and I grabbed a purple, except for I wish it wasn't purple, but I grabbed a purple habit tracker. And I like to use these to mark um, if I've sent orders or worked on orders or anything like that. And then I put the ombre heart checklist down and a this week header. So now I'm going to move on to Monday. So I'm going to be marking my work schedule. I like to mark these on the labels. Um, and I like to use the alarm clocks. I don't know why, I just have always used the clocks. I think they're really cute. So I work on Monday, Wednesday, and Fridays from noon to 5, and then Fridays I work 11 to 5 because Fridays are orientation days. So they're usually a lot busier, and I need to work a little bit earlier than I usually do. All right, so then on Monday, I decided that I was going to put a half box down, and these are mini. Everything in our personal kits are smaller than vertical size stuff, um, including the labels and the weekend banner and stuff like that. So I just put down that I needed to print the scratchers, and obviously I could not spell because this was super late at night. Um, so I printed scratchers. And I also need to fill all of the orders or start filling the orders. And as you can tell, I forgot when I was planning this that those labels are a lot smaller. Um, so I was like, oh, this doesn't go all the way across. And then on Monday, I also need to pay my bills. And then I'm also just using another label to say watch The Bachelorette, which I found out this morning that The Bachelorette isn't on this week, so I can't pull that up though, so I'm going to have to put like a canceled sticker down or something, but it made me so sad. Um, and then I'm just putting that Tuesday is a payday for Etsy, I'm putting a cute little Etsy symbol down. And then usually um, Tuesdays are work days, so I'm going to put a ombre heart checklist down just so I have a bunch of stuff that I need to do on Tuesday. So on a Wednesday, Wednesday I work 12 to 5 again. So here I'm using, I just realized, I was like, I used a plain label, but I forgot that I usually put a icon over it, which is something you guys can do if you have leftover um, labels and you realize that, oh my gosh, I can't use these. You can always use like mini icons or regular sized icons to cover up those, and I think they look really cute. So here I'm going to put a full box down to cover up the rest of the box. I had struggled with this hardcore yesterday. <laughs> and then I'm going to put the label down. That says that I need to edit my haul video, which will be up, I think, on, I decided on Thursday. And then I am also putting down a mini half box thing that I need to design and also do orders if I have any left. I'm hoping to get all of them out by Tuesday, though. So on to Thursday. Thursday is another work day, so what I'm going to do is put a to-do or today header down and an ombre heart checklist. And my camera shut off here, if you can't tell. So I'm going to put a ombre heart checklist, and I was going to do a pink one, but I decided after that to do a blue one. And usually this helps me keep, stay on track when I'm working on orders and working on designs and stuff like that. 
Then I'm going to put a label down, and after I put this down, I realized that it was short. Do you guys see that? So I ripped it up very quickly, and it's because I keep forgetting that these are mini. So I'm going to use one of my regular size labels, which you guys can purchase separately in the shop as well. So I'm going to use a grocery cart label because I most likely will be going grocery shopping for the next week on Thursday. And then I'm also going to be using a, I think it was a laptop sticker because Friday is going to be busy, busy working on new releases and listings and stuff like that. So then I'm putting a film sticker down as well as a laptop sticker down just to mark that I need to um, film a new release video as well as edit a new release video. So I can get that up because new releases are on Saturday this day and I don't believe I put that they were on Saturday. I think in this video I accidentally put that they were on Sunday. But our new releases are going to be on Saturday this day because I'm closing early next week because we are going on vacation and I wanted you guys to have a few extra days and for me to have a few extra days to fill orders. So you guys can order functional stickers and the new release video will be up soon so if you guys want that. You can always go ahead and subscribe to see the new release video. So here I'm just taking a pink ombre heart checklist and cutting it in half. And I'm going to put a header sticker on there just so I, you know, have some room to do some stuff on Saturday. Yep, so I accidentally put that new releases were on Sunday when they are in fact on Saturday this day. And we will be having a sale with new releases this week, but I accidentally put it on the wrong day. So it is going to be on June 18th on Saturday, not Sunday. And there will also be a sampler Sunday slash Saturday as well this week. So here I am just filling everything out. you guys like better if you like the voiceover ones with them being sped up or if you would rather me not do any voiceovers and you guys just watch me plan um, or if you like our regular style plan with me's where I talk through everything let me know down in the comments below so I can kind of figure out what you guys like I would be happy to do a plan with me in my vertical every week as well as then a plan with me sped up in my personal size so much crafting inserts so just let me know and I can always do that for you guys. Um, I like seeing what you guys like the best. So here I'm just adding a few things on Friday, um, but that is about it. <laughs> So that is the full spread in my Kiki K. The only thing I didn't fill out is Thursday's to-do list because it kind of depends on what I get done on Tuesday. But that's it. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this plan with me. If you did, make sure to give the video a thumbs up. And make sure you guys if, subscribe if you're not already. And I'll see you guys in my next video, which will most likely be going up on Thursday so make sure either Wednesday or Thursday so 
make sure to just subscribe so you guys can get notified about that. Also, again, if you guys want to get this kit or any of the new kits that we just put up, I will have a link for those down in the description and you guys can use a coupon code down there as well. So I hope you guys have a good week and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!